when I first came to POMED, my results in grade 11, yeah. term 4, my mathematics was sitting at 44%. My physical science was at 30%. 30%? <laughs> okay. Yeah, through the training of Kutlanong, I moved up, up until I, I obtained Maths Mark 4 to, to be 90, 89%. 89%? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. Gosinati Mguni, Kutlanong ProMets alumnus of the class of 2010, a mathematics teacher at Kutlanong Center for Math, Science and Technology, Katlehong Center. Today I have Gosinati Mguni, one of our alumni from Katlehong Center. Thank you, Babu Mguni, and how are you this morning? I'm good, and how are you? No, I'm fine. I'm good. I'm so happy to be with you in this uh, studio today. Thank you so much. Thank you. Your journey with Promets yeah. from the site of Katlehong. I thought you know about the center 2009. Okay. And then they were looking for two learners from each school, from the 15 uh, feeder schools. So on 2010, we had our class at Kutlano. Okay. And then it was stationed at Bonejo Secondary School. Okay. And then we, we were in 30 in the class. Okay. From the 15 uh, oh, learners. Yes. Okay. And how were your results when you first came to Promets? When I first came to Promets, my results in grade 11, yeah. term 4, my mathematics was sitting at 44%. My physical science was at 30%. 30%? <laughs> <Total score. laughs> okay. Yes. And how did you complete your matric? Yeah, through the training of Kutlanong and then that hardcore push uh, teaching and learning, I moved up, up until I, I obtained Maths Mark 4 to, to be in, 90, 89%. 89%? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you. And your physical sciences? My physical science is a bit challenging, but I managed to, to reach 72%. 72%? Yes. And after your metric, obviously you got a bachelor pass as well. I did get a bachelor okay. pass. Okay, what happened to you after metric? After metric, I was so stubborn to go for teaching. Oh, okay. And they were convincing me to do a actuary at that time at Northwest University. It was the first year they wanted to introduce it. So I was so determined to say I want to do um, education. Oh, okay. Yes. You said you had three options when you finished metric. Which options were they? The first option was I wanted to, to, to do BSc Mathematics. Okay. And then looking at the my skills and talents that I wanted to, to, to apply and work. I was so convinced to say I would be taking education to do teaching and to share the knowledge that uh, I, I've gained from Kutla knowing the discipline, the determination that I've seen from the teachers and I wanted to, to come up with the same uh, model, okay. to, to be a same teacher but a different model that I've learned from Kutlano. Okay. So I was so fascinated to, to do what Kutlano was doing to us as we were the 30. So I had that vision to say, how about I, I, I expand what I've learned from Kutlano, uh -huh. how they do things, let me share with the, the, the other schools. Okay. So the, the first option was um, education. Yeah. And then I had uh, BSc Mathematics. OVRC through late studying about it, it was an actual so but I was so fascinated with education. Okay. Now you are an educator, you are a teacher. I'm an through. educator. Okay. The yeah, new generation educator, not the old teachers, the new one. Okay. Yeah. And you love your career? Definitely I love my teaching. I okay. love education. Okay. Education, seeing edu 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 seeing learners, to be in class, having that face that say you want to hear something from you. Okay. I love that approach when I come in, in class. So uh, I'm a teacher. And you are teaching in the public school? I'm teaching in the public school. Which school are you teaching at? Uh, it's located in Katlong. It's known as Katlong Secondary School. Oh, and school. also over weekends you are teaching, you are back with Kutlanong. Sir. I'm back with Kutlano. Okay. Monday, Monday, Friday, Man, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. And then which subject are you, subjects are you teaching? Currently, I'm teaching mathematics. No, at which grade? Grade 12. Grade 12. Yeah. Now, from Monday to Monday, you are teaching. Monday to Monday, I'm busy with mathematics. And how are your learners performing? At Kutlano, the performance, it was good. Okay. 
uh, we have this certain uh, streaming of learners according to their, um, their potential and abilities uh -huh. whereby we're going to be selecting learners to, to create some class A yes. due to the certain uh, abilities that they have learners and then we're going to be structuring ourselves as teachers at Kutlano to say who can take class A okay. at what uh, skills that might meet those learners okay. and then we we train those learners and then obviously on class A the target is that every learner must get 90% and above. Okay. So last year the performance was very good. Okay. Yes, all in the class class average in their performance it was sitting at 91, 92. Okay. So you can tell that most of them they're, they're, they're at 90%. Okay. So it was good performance. Yeah. Well I'm good. Thank you very much for the opportunity. I wish you all the best in 2024. Thank you so much. Thanks, thanks for the okay, sure. Thank you. Kutwanong Center for Math, Science and Technology. Economic growth solution we need.